Good morning. Good morning. You all right? I'm good, thank you. Welcome to another day on where are we? The Isle of Mull. Yeah. Um not a bad night apart from we had a problem with the car battery again showing that it was dead but it wasn't and this morning it showed it was dead on the indicator in the uh, motorhome but it came around and now it says it's okay so maybe it's a loose battery again I don't know but no problem luckily nobody knocked on us van no one gave us any hassles last night fantastic so feeling good about that but the forecast is for heavy snow coming. Today is heavy rain and we're going over to the Isle of Iona simply because this is going to be his only chance. If it is going to snow, we're not going to get there after today. So we're going over in very heavy rain today. See how we get on. But I think this is going to be his last full day on the Isle of Mull stroke Iona because we want to get onto the mainland. If it's going to be snowing, we don't want to be here. And to be honest with you, we've seen most of the sites we want to see. It's time to get off, isn't it, has it? Yeah. Don't you think? Yeah. And we're running out of money anyway, so I think we're going to get back to the mainland and slowly head back down south and just see sites on the way down. But we're not sure yet. But yeah, we're off to Iona. We're going to see Iona, Abbey, and loads of other cool iona -y stuff. So come with us. In the rain. You're looking good, Mazzy. I feel like a drowned rat. <laughs> <laughs> uh, well, we're on the boat. Yes. Um, that's Iona in the background. Is it? Yep. It's literally just over there. You could swim to it if you wanted to, but we're not doing that. We're very well wrapped up. Yeah. I don't know how the filming's going to go today because it's going to be very hard. I think we're mental going over. We are never. mental, but this yeah. is his only chance. We probably yeah. would never get to Iona ever again, would we? No. So today's the day. Yeah. So this shows you how close it is, guys. That is the island, and that is the abbey. This is like the central attack attraction on Iona. That's where we're going. The boat, I think, stops about there. Then we'll just have to walk to there to get to the uh, to the abbey. There's a few things to see. There's an abbey, a nunnery. Uh, what else is there? There's quite a few, but I don't know now if we'll get to see as much as we wanted today. We'll, we'll just see how it goes, yeah. won't we? Yeah. But at least we're going to get there. One other little problem we had last night is the cable which I charged the laptop with has melted. Now, someone sent us a lovely gift uh, which we're supposed to plug things into. And stupidly I didn't, I plugged it straight in and it melted. So but we've had it in there loads of times, haven't we? And it's yeah. been okay. Um, but it melted, so now I can't charge the laptop up unless we're on mains or generator. So tonight we're gonna have to put the generator on to charge the laptop and hope we can get you a video tonight. There was just an announcement, you know, like a safety instructions type thing. And it said, in case of an emergency, you'll hear seven short blasts on the horn. Wouldn't it be safer to have two? You know, seven blasts takes quite a long time to come through. We could have sunk by then. That doesn't make sense, does it? Why seven? Two is sufficient, trust me. If you give us two, we'll know there's trouble and we'll sort things out. Seven, we'll be dead. The thing about going to the toilet on a boat or a train, they should have a chalkboard on the wall and give you points for the least amount of splashes which don't go in the bowl. Like I, I know for a fact I've, I've got like three or four splashes outside the bowl, so I, I won't be able on a, any kind of leaderboard. I probably would be for today because I'm the first person to use this toilet, but uh, yeah, it's so hard to have a wee. On a boat or on a train. I don't think I did too bad then. So this is St. Ronan's Chapel. It's it's a nunnery of some kind, I think. I don't really know much about it, but I've just read this plaque and it's really interesting. It says in med it's a medieval church. People worshipped worshipped here between 1200 
and 1560. That's a long time ago. But it also says there's traces of even older, going back to the year 700, of a chapel here before. And even before then, there's traces of burials from even before 700. This is a very, very, very ancient site. This is quite exciting. And there's lots of graves around here. But the fascinating thing is, everyone in all the graves are women. No men. Where's the men? Where's the men? I'm liking this. This is proper history. This is like 1,300 years old stuff, is this. Loving it. Loving it. I know I look like a nipple, but just try to see past the nipple and look at the breast. Look at the breast. It is beautiful. Like, where we stood at the moment might not look much to you, but I can assure you we love it, don't we? This is the most sheltered part on the <laughs> island. <laughs> it's peeing it down. It's... Due snow, it's gale force winds, but we, we're dressed for the occasion, aren't we? Kind of, yeah. What do you mean, kind of? We are, we are. This is all right. I, I can do this all day long. say down here don't miss the vaulted ceiling of this little chapel upstairs was the sacristy where altar vessels and vestments were stored now that's very interesting but you can't get up you can't get up there let me just adjust your lightness you can see the ceiling there sort of uh, and to get upstairs you'd have to go through this door which is locked um, but do you have any idea what you're stood next to a sacred well and you yeah. haven't even seen it yet, down here. The sacred well. That's thousands of years old. People have gone there, gives them eternal life and heals all their problems. You're winding me up. How do you know I'm winding you up? Because it's a puddle. All right, it's a puddle, <laughs> but I've got to talk about something. <laughs> Mazzy's just walked straight across it, thinking it's just a step. It's a grave you stood on there, Mazzy. What? And all these graves, as I said, these are all women. I wonder why they were all women. There's no, like, explanation. Mind you, if it was a nunnery, yeah. it will be, won't it? They'll all be women. <laughs> a lot of uh, restoration going on at the moment, by the look of it. In here was the garden, the nunnery's garden. Just in here. I know that because there's some daffodils down there. You only get daffodils in a garden. I can only guess this was a theatre. That's where you'd sit, and that looks like a stage. Be a nice little theatre, that. If you were sat in the middle, yeah, I could cope with that. You'd get a really good view, wouldn't you? That's where they'd come down uh, to sit down, and the lady would come with the snacks, you know, your popcorn and stuff like that. <laughs> Yeah, and you'd watch uh, the nuns. It'd all be women. It'd be an all-female all female cast doing Les Miserables or whatever they call it or something like that. Les Miserables. How do you pronounce it? Do you know? I don't know. I've never no. seen it. don't know it. anything about it. Les Miserables or something like that. What's this? Oh, no, it's not a theatre. It's the chapter house. The nuns met here daily to confess their sins. Okay. Would you like to confess any sins while you're here? Um, Come on, what have you done wrong? I forgot to give you some pancakes yesterday on pancake day. Please you forgive forgot me. to give me pancakes yeah. on pancake day yesterday. Please forgive me. <laughs> I'm finding it hard to forgive you for that one, I really am. Uh, I only remembered last night in bed, I thought, oh. <laughs> Need pancakes. Maybe yeah, tonight. Maybe tonight. You're having a laugh. You're having a laugh, aren't you? This is the warming room, Mazzy. This is where the nuns came to thaw out on cold days because this is the warmest place in the nunnery. They're having a laugh, it's freezing. It's freezing in here. Warmest place in the nunnery. <laughs> You've got a plaque up here, I don't know if you can see it, but it says in memory of Robina Jarvis Spencer, whose children have preserved the ruins. 
1922. Why didn't Robina do it herself? Why did she get her children to do it? You'd think it's quite a dangerous job restoring a place like this and she just gets her children to do it while she sits at home drinking cups of tea. Now this is an amazing story. Apparently in the refectory, which I believe is this behind us, there is like a carving of a lady with her legs wide open. And apparently it's supposed to ward off evil. Leg, yeah. Women with the legs <laughs> apart wards off evil apparently. I've never heard that before and I can't see it on there. And I, I think what they're trying to say is you can't get past the scaffolding. So all us are evil and we can't get in there. I'm not seeing it. I really want to see a woman with her legs apart in a nunnery. That'd be quite unique, wouldn't it? No, we can't see it anywhere. Mazzy seems to think it might be there, but I'm not seeing anything. But it is a pretty special uh, window, is that? I do like how it's been restored though. I presume this is similar to how it would have looked, but with the big red bricks and slate in between. That's quite cool. Mazzy might have been right, actually. So there's a picture of it there, that's the lady with the legs open and it looks like that is above that window. I think Mazzy is right, you know, but it's so faint you can hardly see it. But that's the woman with her legs open up there. Anyone out there got any ideas what this is? There's two of them. I can't think, can you? Grinding stone. It is like a grinding stone, but you've got like two things there. Yeah, but that would catch whatever you're grinding, like the, the flower, let's say. If you put seeds around there, that all your flower would go down in the group. Possibly. I, I hope you're so. right. I do hope you're right. I've no idea myself. And that would probably be the one on top, would it not? I don't know. No, I don't know. I don't think it is, but uh, you might be right. If someone knows what they are, please tell us. We'd love to know. Mazzy thinks that went on top. No, maybe not that the on top, but storm. I think that's a grinding stone, yeah. yeah. <laughs> Hello. Hello. Come on then. Come on then. Come here then. Come on then. Come on then. Oh, you ignorant git.